the Epic Games Store launches self-publishing. Woo! So until then, uh, it was not possible for you to self-publish on Epic Games, or at least it was harder. A small image right there showing you how to do it. It's pretty simple. You sign up to dev.epicgames, you log in, create your accounts, you do all of the stuff. You pay a hundred dollar submission per game, just like Steam. It's the same thing. Then you build your page, you submit it to testing. The big difference with uh, the Epic Games Store is that you keep 88% of the revenue compared to Steam, where you keep only 70%. That's the biggest difference here. Also, the backend in the Epic Games Store is just much better so earlier i tried i log in with my developer account and i started working on the thing for dashpong and honestly it's just much better it's it feels responsive it's easy to understand what you're doing and uh it it's really easy you go from one step to another it's really clear it's fast it looks modern honestly i'm really excited uh, i think that personally i will try to push to put my game on the store I just have to figure out the integration with Epic, which is maybe not the easiest thing to do with Godot at the moment, but this might change. As you're saying, Smacks, we have to see how it's going to do for shovelwares and asset flips and stuff like that. I think the same question was asked when Steam did it and people were afraid that it was uh, going to be horrible. And in a way, it was for a while. Um, I think the store was flooded with shitty games and asset flips and stuff like that. And that's why they put the $100 fee. But even, even with that, it's not a huge thing to overcome. But I think it's okay. In the end, it's okay because you have an algorithm, you have rating system. So if you made a shitty game, then it's just going to stay buried in the in the deep in the deep ocean of all of the games that are out there. So personally, as a game dev, I'm excited because it means that I have another storefront available for me with a better deal. Um, do they have ratings and comments? I think they do. I think they do. I think I remember seeing the ratings at least. For the comments, I'm not sure, but I think they have a star system and they have open critic integration. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool, actually. As you can see here, those are the requirements. PC crossplay for multiplayer games, Epic Store achievements, you have to have the same achievements, the age ratings for regional distribution. So this is an age rating thing that they are doing for you and some prohibited contents which is actually interesting they don't want you to put scams and frauds and stuff like that but most importantly you can't have on the storefront you can't have porn games basically and they are huge on steam so we won't see that on the epic game store they don't want porn games i don't know what to think about that is it a good thing is it a bad thing i don't know uh i know that it's I know that it's a huge part of the Steam ecosystem, uh, but honestly, I think this is a good thing. I don't know what you think, uh, but personally, as a developer, I think it's a good thing.